Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and video from four inch PVC clean out downstairs just behind the water heater as you can see. We're gonna go ahead and give a second opinion on the sewer line and also look for clean outs that possibly are installed. Okay, here's our transition from PVC to clay. I don't really see too much of a concern there. Okay, so there's the main. As you can see, there's a little bit of a crack in there we might want to keep an eye on in the future. But I see no issue with the clay. If you got some root intrusion, we're going to pull back and go ahead and look for the clean out. Okay, there's something here, if you see to the left side of the camera by the footage, I'm going to go ahead and locate that. That may be a clean out of some sort, so let's see if I can go find it outside. Okay, this is the tie-in for the upstairs unit in the garage. Also, I found in the garage for the water heater, there's a 4-inch clean out in there. We'll continue to pull back. Okay, here's the situation. The clay looks alright. We need to keep an eye on it. 
definitely may need some replacement. Can't give a you know a time when. Um, no cleanouts, but I think the reason why there is no cleanouts is because that four inch clean out in the garage by the water heater is an access point. Plus you have an access point in the house, therefore it does not need clean outs. All I do recommend at this time is to snake every nine months for preventative maintenance. Video every other year, every two years, just to keep an eye on that clay. But everything looks good. Those are my recommendations.